Attra especially men. Attraction is important. It's important to everybody. Let's just be real. But now I want you to understand something. Okay. You're perfectly fine. You've said you felt like he's not attracted to you anymore. Right. That doesn't have to be the case. Do not bear the responsibility when you're being cheated on. Okay. This is my problem right here, man. Sometimes it is your fault. Sometimes you can't control yourself and you cause these problems. Sometimes you're too goddamn needy and you don't give him any space. Sometimes you overexpose yourself and he's grown tired of you. Sometimes you think you take him for granted and you stop dressing up. Sometimes it is your fault. And, 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 and you need to have good perspective to know what you had responsible and what was his innate personality per se but a lot of times cheating has two things one your fault making him bored right let's just keep it real and also his fault which is his his own habits all right let's keep watching this motherfucker it ain't yours look at this girl clapping do not put that vest on every day oh i'm not what a man wants no you fine some of these guys, and they'll tell you, they're just butthole. Yes, some of them are, but you got to realize that there is a, biologic, there is a biological um, side to attraction. And, in, and that side isn't all roses and, and, and Disney magic. It's, it's reality, and, and sometimes that's, that it, it, it's a little superficial. But at the end of the day, people become attracted to other people um because they're scarce you see what i'm saying and 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 and, and people become a, a become want to see more of the other person because they either cause them pain they hurt their ego and when you do that properly you could sort of diminish um cheating but then you have the other part which is his side which is his personality his character and that's something you got to be able to assess someone's character their propensity to cheat and and you can learn how to do that, but it takes time and it takes patience and it takes you not being emotional, right? But it, this whole thing that you're perfect, that's not true. That's not true. Clearly, if you're if you're overweight, you're gonna struggle finding the right guy. You're, you're lowering your, your, your chances of meeting the right guy, right? Now, when it comes to aging, there's nothing you could do about that. But with, with maintaining what you have, yes, you could, you know? And sometimes it's all about optimizing what you have to increase the chances of you getting what you want. You see, um, but at the same time, you don't want to feel like the victim, like, oh, you know, me, I always get cheated on. That's why I think that what he's trying to say. But then there's the other side, which is looking at your behavior pragmatically and saying, oh, I get cheated on because I'm too needy. You don't have to feel like the victim, but you could just like realize it, see it and change it. Like you're almost like you're changing your shoes because one of your shoes is not working. Let's see what this dude has to say. Drink the whole jug of water when a guy cheats on you. That's not your... The whole jug, but take a sip. That's not your fault. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Look, man, if you if you were nagging him, if you weren't giving him what he wants, you know, and, and, and you know what I mean by giving him what he wants. I mean, look, those things are, are, are just... If the restaurant that I go to all the time stops cooking better, I'm going to another restaurant. If my mom can't cook food, I'm not eating at my mom's face. I'm going to go to another mom. <laughs> you know, like, I feel like I wouldn't eat that food and go somewhere else. Simple as that. Looking like a model, because hell, we don't. <laughs> I don't look like I looked when I was 30. <laughs> I'm still so fine, though. All right, all right. Relax, like Steve Harvey. And <laughs> hey, you know And let me tell you something. And, 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 and let me tell you something, lady. Sometimes you just have to tell yourself that. I just. Hey, man. You know, I appreciate his desire to make it feel good, but at the end of the day, if you keep. She said she'd been cheated on before. If you don't. If, you keep, if those things keep happening, it doesn't mean that the guys are the ones that are doing it. There's something that you're doing that's causing it. And realizing that it's you the problem, I don't want you to say, oh, no, you know, I suck. No, I want you to say, what am I doing and how can I change it? Simple as that. All right? Anyways.